good morning you guys and as you can probably tell I'm not in LA there's my mother Hola, ¿me quieres decir hola? <laughs> so actually in Phoenix right now just for the weekend I'm actually gonna go back to LA tomorrow if you didn't see my previous vlog my little sister was staying with me for a week in LA and the time has finally come and I had to bring her back to Phoenix so I've been here for like two days at this point today has been a really really slow morning I woke up like at 10 a.m. pretty much crawled out of bed started answering emails I've been drinking some coffee and yeah just chilling hanging out with my mom and and uh, watching a movie so that's how my morning's going I'm trying to go back on track and trying to implement healthier habits into my life just because I feel like quarantine has really made me lazy and sluggish and I just like have not worked out at all I mean maybe like once in a while but I want to be consistent about it okay that's it and I want to eat healthier too I feel like I've been you know just eating a lot of processed foods and eating out a lot so today we're gonna be cooking with my mom which is something that I know you guys love and working out I'm gonna try and I know you guys may be wondering why the sudden urge to work out and eat healthy consistently and it's because guys back in the day like in the beginning of quarantine when I was doing that I felt so much confidence I had so much energy so much happiness overall my mental health was like at its best and you know there's nothing wrong with gaining weight in quarantine like gyms are closed in LA for the most part so I don't really have a solid place to work Workout. what's been helping me is finding a workout that I can bring with me everywhere like right now I travel to Phoenix and I mean it's not like I can just like walk into any gym unless like my mom or someone in my family had a gym membership I have to bring the workout with me which brings me to the sponsor of today's video I've been trying out this fitness app called Verve to implement some healthy workouts into my life these workouts are way more intense than they seem they seem so easy on the app but then you actually do it and I'm like dripping sweat by the end of it I actually filmed a workout video for Verve's YouTube channel with my roommate and it's kind of comical to say the least oh we were supposed to do both legs I guess <laughs> So if you guys want a good laugh and a good workout, I'll add a link down below so you guys can watch it after this video. But on a serious note, I definitely recommend the app if you guys are serious about getting back on track. What I really love about it is that there are different workouts that you can do. They have like yoga ones, they have HIT, they also have like sleep melodies to help you go to bed, and they have these like workout programs you can do so you're like sticking to something every single day. You do have to pay a subscription to use the app, but like I said, I highly recommend it. They have hundreds of recipes on there, they have so many workouts to choose from so if you guys want to check out the app want to learn more about it I'll add a link down below so you guys can check it out for yourself and yeah with all that being said I'm actually gonna do one of their workouts today because it's so easy like it's an app on my phone I don't have a yoga mat I'm literally gonna work out on this towel because I forgot my yoga mat at home and I would be working out outside there's more space to like run and do stuff and like jumping jacks that kind of thing but it's over 100 degrees so I'm just gonna work out in here and hopefully it goes well Ooh, all right, so I'm gonna do a booty shaper one because want that girl to be raised up a bit. So it's only seven minutes, which is dope. You can choose how long you want it. And they have dope playlists to choose from. Damn, I'm really selling this app. No, but seriously, they have like really, really good playlists. Like literally, when I was listening to it with my roommate, we were both thinking like, damn, we should play this at our next pregame or something. Okay, I'm, I'm just gonna start working out. <laughs> Okay, that was super quick. I did a booty workout and then I did an ab workout right after. Total was a little over 12 minutes. Not that much. I could honestly do another one, but it's already 12. I have some errands to run, so I think I just need a shower and then get ready for the day. I'm out of breath. I'm also really hungry, so I think I'm going to cut up some fruit, shower, and see what else today brings. <laughs> Bye. <laughs> <laughs> mm. 
This is probably my favorite thing about coming home. Because I'm so well fed. ¿Qué andas haciendo? Mom. My mom always buys so much fruit when I come. My favorite fruit of all time just has to be mango. And she bought so many for me. That's good stuff. You know what will make this even better though? Some banana fam. My favorite thing is just to eat them together. Get a piece of that banana. Get a piece of that mango. Make a little kebab. Mm. Okay, I'm gonna finish this up. And then I'll see you guys in a bit. Mira cómo se pone para no tocar tu popote. Wow, gracias. De nada. Te voy a hacer sentir. <risa> Más bien, yo sentí. Oh, no digas eso. <risa> Salud. Salud. All right. Yeah, estamos listas. What's up, guys? So, me and my mom are going to go to the mall. Hacer de compras. <laughs> a ver qué encontramos. We just picked up some iced coffee. I need to buy, like, an, like, a suit for an Instagram post. Is that extra? Yes, and I didn't want to go alone, so I stole my mommy and brought her with me. Okay, lista? Vámonos. So we are back from the mall. I am so tired, my feet hurt. Also, we stopped by Trader Joe's and picked up a few goodies. I actually ate this in the car because I was so starving. I could not wait. Thank God I have hand sanitizer in my car because I drowned my hands in it. I think I threw away the box already, but like the veggie wrap from Trader Joe's. And I also got some like pita chips some olives and then three layer hummus. And then right now I'm just drinking the GT kombucha and then this is like one of their fall flavors. It has apple, turmeric, carrot and other spices and it tastes like fall in a bottle. Like I'm not even kidding you. Oh, it just tastes like apple cider kind of, but like with a hint of carrot juice. I don't even know, it tastes so good though. Oh, also very exciting. I got a new plant. This is called uh, Kaluna, I think. I've never seen this before, but it's so pretty. And then the reason for this mall trip. So I wanted to buy a suit, like a set. You know, I wanted to get the blazer and the pants. And I don't know, all the ones that I found were either like out of budget or like the quality didn't feel that great. So we went to Macy's and I honestly wasn't expecting to get anything because Macy's like, it's pretty much expensive, you know? I went into their sales section and you guys, look at this beautiful blazer coat. It's from Calvin Klein. Look, it has this like pretty gold chain right here. I got this in a size six. So guess, guess how much this would be. I'm talking to my sister, by the way. Probably $70. $70. You guys can guess down below. $15. $15. $15. Okay, this isn't the best outfit to go with this, but. Wow. Oh, she's classy. $15, are you kidding me? The sales section is where it's at, that's for sure. I feel like I had a very productive day. Really great, honestly. Good purchase. I worked out a little bit and um, I'm eating great food. Also, if there are any environmentalists out there, I'm aware this is bad, okay? I've told my mom about it so many times. She just, she doesn't learn. She just loves buying her bottled waters, okay? Just don't judge my mom, okay? She's not perfect. <laughs> Anyways, I'll talk to you guys later. All right, so I am going to make the famous cauliflower ceviche that I showed in my What I Eat in a Week in Mexico. Pues ma, explícale en la cámara. Explícale a tus fans. Pretty much what you do is just you cut up the raw cauliflower really small and then we're going to steam it for, I don't even know how long. We're just full Oh, like two minutes because we still want a crunch to it. I don't want it to be like super soft. But if you want to use raw cauliflower, I'm pretty sure you can do that. 